This woman is really amazing. She pulls out a playing card and can turn it into a bank card to pay. She moves her fingers and time immediately rewinds. Even if she touches her ear, the dirty home becomes clean immediately. Even the wires and cables will be put in their place. The housekeeping staff worships her when they see this. Isabel is a witch. She is tired of living in the witch world. So she came to the human world. She wanted to live a normal life, even in the rain. She will be happy like a child. Her greatest hope was to find someone who could love her. She didn't expect that her love god Cupid would come in just a few days. Jack is an overrated actor who desperately needs to make a movie to become famous. He wants to find an unpopular actress as his sidekick. By coincidence, he meets Isabel in a bookstore who looks exactly like the witch in the movie. With his sweet talk, Isabel quickly agrees to his offer and comes to the TV station for an audition. Both the director and the producer were very satisfied with her performance. But that's because they didn't know that the person in front of them was a real witch. Isabel was able to find a job as a film actress. She sat her day at home watching her boss's performance, trying to learn and apply it. In this way, Isabel also develops feelings for Jack. Just when she thought she was about to have a sweet relationship, she accidentally overheard a conversation between Jack and his agent. Their words were full of slander against her. She runs off the set in anger, intending to leave. Her two best friends follow her out and comfort her patiently. Isabel suddenly feels that she can't just walk away from this scumbag. So she goes back to the set, does her magic when no one is looking, and embarrasses Jack in front of everyone else. She thought Jack just liked to talk bad about people, but in the interview, Jack shamelessly told the media that Isabel's signature nose move was taught to him by himself. Isabel, whose anger had subsided, was instantly furious. She planned to quit her job and never see this disgusting man again. But at that moment, her aunt suddenly fell out of the closet, and to get back at Jack, her aunt cast a spell. The man inhaled a cloud of air while he was sleeping, and he woke up with a very different temperament. Not only is he very polite to the new actress, he usually despises, but he also invites her on a date with him. Even though he wants to refuse, his body is not in control. Isabel runs home frantically, hoping her aunt can lift the magic on Jack. However, her aunt who only knows how to cause trouble but not to solve problems. Left for Japan by snapping her fingers, leaving her to deal with the problem by herself. Although Isabel says that she doesn't want to go out with Jack, but she still dresses up carefully. She opens the door and receives flowers and gifts from Jack and is instantly happy. Faced with Jack's attentiveness, Isabel soon falls in love with him. She and Jack went out to dinner together. It was only when he took her home to say goodbye that she came to her senses. She moved her fingers to rewind time to the day. Her aunt came to the house, and she woke Jack up completely, and Jack did revert to his old self. After he sees that Isabel has more votes than him in the popular role of the newly aired drama, his self-esteem is bruised, and he immediately insults her. She looked at Jack with disappointment and angrily called him an asshole. She then resolutely left, but Jack changed his attitude and fell in love with her after being scolded by her. He not only begged her to go back to acting, but actually began to pursue her. After seeing Jack's sincerity, she also falls in love quickly because she has been expecting love. But then, Jack's ex-wife, who had seen him become famous again, came to her and wanted to get back together with him. Isabel was so jealous, she cast a magic spell, a big lamp smashed down and pinned her ex-wife to the ground. When she felt that it was too much, she turned back the clock and used a blower to prank his ex-wife. She also managed to get her ex-wife to agree to sign divorce papers with Jack. With a broom in his hand, the man flew up into the sky and even swung around in midair. And it was all his girlfriend's magic. He landed easily and picked up a tree branch to protect himself. This makes his girlfriend sad. She rode the broom and left. Jack is happy to get the promise of divorce from his ex-wife and is ready to celebrate with a party at his home. Many people are invited to the party. Isabel doesn't want to hide too much anymore. She plans to tell Jack that she is a witch. Despite her father's persuasion, she makes her decision. But no matter what she said, Jack thought she was joking, even if she immediately conjures an umbrella in the cup or snap fingers to make the TV show her in the screen. Jack thinks it's just magic. Isabel got angry and left. Jack saw the situation and immediately went after her. Isabel waved her hand, and a magic broom appeared from her hand. Jack thought it was another prop, but Isabel told him to hold it. He took it without thinking, and the next moment he was taken up to the sky. After being put down, Isabel happily asks him if he can trust himself. But Jack's reaction was not at all like she imagined but looked at her with a frightened face. Isabel had to leave sadly after the breakup, 
The TV station recruited a new actor for the role, but after auditioning a lot of women, Jack thought Isabel was the best, but he couldn't convince himself to stay with a witch until he hears from his best friend that Isabel is coming home and witch will not be allowed to leave the house for 100 years. Jack's mind keeps flashing back to the happy times he and Isabel had together. He couldn't lie to himself anymore and drove with his friend all the way to the set to find Isabel. They finally could not suppress their thoughts. They kiss each other and decide to stay together for the rest of their lives. They drive to a villa. Jack carries Isabel out of the car and walks into the house to start their new life together. This time they are finally honest with each other and will not be separated. This is the end of the film. It is successful as a fantasy romantic comedy. The heroine portrays the witch very well. She is very good in both her cute image and her sad and crying face. They also have a good ending in the end. The tree that blossomed quickly at the door. Perhaps symbolizing their love. This is the end of today's movie. See you next time.